if you have not heard Chef Carmen putting it out there about trees, let me tell you, and you're going to want to watch this entire video because I'm going to tell you something at the end. Oh my goodness. Yo, and what I'm going to tell you is in reference to Chef Carmen. Huh? And trees. This beef I knew nothing about until about 12 hours ago. Sorry, I'm just available to bring it to you now. Here's your story. Chef Carmen made three lives talking about trees. She ain't no friend. She said she thought Treese was a friend. She said she ain't no friend. She said she don't even know how to be a mom. She said, how 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 can she be a friend with her idea of friendship is, what's the word that she used? You being a puppy. You have to like who she likes. She wants you to like. You have to be friends with who she wants you to be friends with. If she don't like them, she don't want you to be friends with them. She talked about all that. I don't know what. Tree said about the LGBT community, but Chef Carmen, y'all call her Chef Carmen. Carmen is upset about something involving LGBT. I don't know what. Um, she mentioned you don't love your kids. You never love your kids. You're a narcissist. She said next to every dictionary in the world, Tree's picture should be next to the word narcissist. Um, she Carmen said. You gave your kids up so easy. She said she's giving her kids up right now. This was 12 hours ago. So you know more than me because I don't watch trees. A video come across, I, eh, 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 I get past it. Um, I'm going to start exercising and listening to trees so I can get caught up on what the hell is going on because oh my goodness I don't want to miss a second of it oh my I'm not going to miss a second of it oh believe me you I'm going to catch this <sighs> Carmen said trees is giving up the kids right now but she already gave Courtney up he was the first to go the twins were next then Rennie speaking of Rennie uh, Carmen said Rennie is starting to twerk. She's learned it from Treese. She said the kids are stealing. She said they learned it from you, Treese. Carmen said she was there for the B situations. B, that lady. She said uh, she was there for that. She's seen a lot of that. She said uh, while it's on my mind, Carmen said it's not funny. I'm guessing Treese is making videos with people digging in her nose. <laughs> Or and making videos with people picking up her dirty sanitary napkins because Carmen mentioned that you're um you're washed up. You may have been making good money during the pandemic, but you're not making good money in anymore. No one even watches you. Your views are down. You complain to your friends or you complain to us that your views are down. Um you, you got people digging in your nose. That's not funny. You got people picking up your dirty sanitary napkins. That's not funny. Uh, Carmen said she was there for whatever the B situation was. Whatever went down with B at the house. She said she was there for the Coco situation. She said Coco should have told the jail system, I don't want to go out. Give me life in prison before I go to her house. Carmen said she was a witness when she was there at Treese house cooking greens. She said she was a witness to Treese sitting there on the phone trying to pay someone to do something to someone. Carmen said, let's bring that back. Carmen said she was there. She's a witness to Treese. She was there cooking greens at Treese house and she she was she's a witness to trees calling people trying to pay somebody to do something to somebody she said yo i would love to testify in court yo if anybody need me to testify in court like i'm willing i'm ready to testify in court like yo i'm going to tell you where you can find this live at 
So you want to keep watching this video. I'm going to tell you the name of the live so you can pull it up just by typing it in the Facebook search bar and then it come right up. Oh, don't miss it. Carmen said she, now mind you, these are all accusations we heard about Trees Kamui. Y'all remember last year, um, Keisha T. Rushwell saying, uh, Treese was trying to pay somebody, trying to hire somebody to do something to somebody. Yeah, yeah, we heard. Yeah, Carmen said she's a witness. Um, she mentioned, Carmen mentioned some other people in Texas, some, some, something at the house. I don't remember. I don't know. Um, the juicier stuff is that Carmen says she will Will Smith Treese. Carmen says she'll Will Smith Treese. Carmen, shut up. You're lying. Again, you're lying. As you've been lying to your platform, you're lying. Let me tell you about Carmen, yo. <laughs> Let me tell you about Carmen. <laughs> Carmen is sitting there on live. Again, it's just 12 hours ago. She's on live. And I guess her numbers were real high. And she realized, oh, my God, my numbers are extremely higher than normally. So she totally went off the rail. She was like, yo, y'all better follow me. Follow me because I feed the homeless. I've been doing this for 15 years. I give back. Me and my business partner, Karina, we are a small black business and we give back to the community with our money. Like, follow me. Y'all better follow me. And she talked about trees. You're so dramaless. She said next to narcissist should be trees name and another word should be trees name. She said, um, Exodus, Exodus. Is it Exodus in, in the Bible? She said the book of Exodus should be Tree's picture. I don't, I don't know what the book of Exodus is about. She make me want to read the book of Exodus. Um, wow. She said Trees is drama. She always screaming. She don't want drama on her page. The same thing we all know. She don't want drama on her page. Her, her page, her platform ain't about drama, but every video, every skit she do is drama. Yeah, yeah, yeah uh-huh, yeah. She said um, her bottom is falling out. But Carmen wants to fight trees. Carmen wants to put hands on trees. Carmen wants to put hands on trees. And I'm going to say this. Um, I'm not a violent person. I don't condone that mess. But I will put my money on trees. Even though the world done said the world of Florida, Ridians, the Florida Rid the Floridians that know Latrice Island have said shh, shh, they no good. She probably fight like this. They said she no good with these. They said she don't. I mean slow. <laughs> 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 Said she no good with those. They said Trees no good with those. Um, whoever those people were, in those few videos, um, the clips that were sent to me, I don't know why, but <sighs> she said Coco should have told the prison system, "I'll do life in prison. Don't release me to her." See, did she talk about the dirty house? She did say. Yeah, 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 yeah. She said, because Coco knew her. She said, Coco, you knew her beforehand. You shouldn't have went there. Yeah. That boy had a goal in mind. <laughs> um, what else did she say? Y'all got to catch it. It is very deep. She came back apologizing for talking about the kids. I don't know what... She, she didn't, my bad, erase that. Carmen came back with a second live saying she want to apologize to anyone that she offended or anyone that thinks she was talking about the kids. She said, I was not talking about the kids. She said, I was not talking about the kids. I did not hear Carmen talk about the kids. I heard Carmen say she's not a mother. Who sit on live? Who sit on live all them hours all day talking about people who sit on live talking about people all day 
while your kids are off doing only you will never know. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. And we all know the Rennie situation with her brother, one of the twins, you know what I mean? Then tried to try to do something. Thank God she a little beast and was able to push him off of her. The lady with the all them kids that were at her house, she gave that four wheeler to, walked in and seen Rennie pushing him off of her. Like she said, Rennie's starting to twerk. Rennie's starting to twerk? She's like nine. She's starting to twerk? She said she'll go to court with bells on, whistling like a tea kettle. Um, Carmen, you looking like you starting to age. I know you're almost 60, but whew, God. She said, um, <laughs> Carmen said, Therese is talking about her love life. She's like, my love life is intact. Currently, it's intact. Carmen, your love life, I've been watching you for, what, 10 years? No, ooh, Jesus, 13, 14 years. Your love life, um, revolving door, 10 months, 1 year, 11 months. That's your relationships. That's not a relationship. That's a situation, <laughs> But that's how you get down. And it's always you do something like, I don't like to say bipolar because everyone has mood swings. It's called being human. If you don't have, like, listen, but you're something's wrong with you. Yeah. She said, um, she said, Therese needs to be in counseling the rest of her life. She need mental health therapy the rest of her life. <laughs> um, Carmen, so do you. So, so do you, so do you, so do you. I watched the live or the replay of the live a few months ago when you and your granddaughter were at your home and your granddaughter did something to the settings and had the TV or in Spanish, right? And Carmen was spazzing out, snapping out, like throwing a tantrum, couldn't control herself. Yeah, um, yeah, you need help. You need help. Why you think Stephanie deleted your page? You need help. <laughs> um, I don't remember Carmen saying anything about Trees' lack of cleanliness. I can say Carmen and Anita we're real friends to trees. Yeah. Yeah. Carmen and whatever the African lady named that ended up using Carmen for to build her platform and left her alone. <laughs> you do dirt, you get dirt. I love it. What they say, karma. They say what goes around, come around with some mess or another. Yeah, I watched it. Is Carmen used trees for a club? Trees, Carmen said, Carmen said on this 12 hour, on, on this live 12 hours ago, she said, you always talking about somebody clout chasing, you clout chasing right now. That's, that's what Carmen said. She said, you always talking about somebody clout chasing, you clout chasing right now. So are you admitting to you were clout chasing before? Because I remember the lot, but I'm not going to comment on you because your video is coming soon, Carmen. Your video is coming soon. This video here set me back another one. And I'm already behind. Still got to put Wendy out there. And Darius and you. So yours is coming right now. Let's 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 focus, y'all. Let's focus. Everything shy crew. Listen, I call y'all the everything crew because y'all rock with me. Everything I do, dig it right. Don't forget to check out the Facebook page. It's everything shy. The fan page is Instagram. Yes, I have an Instagram fan page. The name of that is Everything Shy as well. I'm on TikTok and Clubhouse. My name on those two platforms is Everything Shy. You guessed it. Carmen 
and this African lady on Valentine's Day. Carmen and her Valentine's date, a straight woman. I have to put that out there. I can't say Carmen and a Valentine's date without saying a straight woman because she played herself. Um, I, although it's nothing wrong with a lesbian and a straight woman going on a dinner date, it's nothing wrong with that. Like, I wish I could remember her name. Y'all know who I'm talking about. Carmen and this lady went to Tree's house and cooked for Tree's, Coco, and the children. And they cleaned the house. Not cleaned the house, my bad. They cleaned the kitchen. The lady is in there with her red dress on, doing the dishes, cleaning. Yeah, cleaning the dishes. You hear the dishes. You hear the dishes as she's loading them and like... The dish drainer as she's washing them. You hear the broom going across the floor. You hear this. Shh, 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 shh. The broom. It's Carmen sweeping the kitchen. Trees is sitting on Facebook Live. Coco is sitting next to her. And you hear the dishes in the background. This at the old house. Y'all know this was at the old house. Um. The trash cans piled up in the kitchen. It was like two of them metal trash cans. I don't know. Two trash cans and the trash was piled up on top of the trash can. Like, so you're not putting something in the trash. You're putting something on the trash. Two cans piled up, but you got a man sitting there next to you. You got two women in your kitchen cleaning so they can cook for you. And your man for Valentine's Day. Trees. Yeah, yeah. And again, Carmen swept that floor. It sounded like a, a large swish broom. Witch broom. Y'all remember the old school witch broom? I can't pronounce it. Switch broom, the little broom. Like it sounded like one of those type brooms, but a big one. Like, like it was crazy, man, how you could hear it. She was sweeping that floor so hard. Um they both tall, too. They both 5'9". All three was the same height. 5'9". Treason got more weight, um, more mouth. Carmen said, Treason's the Facebook bully. She's a Facebook bully. She can't stand bullies. She hate bullies. She hate Treason. She said, Treason's a Facebook bully. Now, throughout, I said, Valentine's Day. Carmen in there with her blazer on. Her Valentine's gear looking wax. I stopped it. Um, she was looking festive for Valentine's Day. Like, um, can't believe I came back and said it politically correct. Like, yeah. uh, man, you gotta love this. I I love it. 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 And I thank y'all for watching. I thank you in advance for watching me right now. Thank you. For Carmen and her date to walk into the house knowing they were going in there to cook and see that the conditions of the kitchen and not turn around and say, hey, go come back and do this another time. They didn't say that. They actually was like, come on, we got to do what we got to do. We had to do this job. Let's make it happen. And to not talk about that when the ish hit the fan right now. And I'll tell you, I did not hear Carmen talk about Trees and her lack of cleanliness. I didn't hear her talk about that. I heard her talk about a lot of other stuff. Her character and all that. That was a friend. She was a friend. And I'm going to tell you this, right? A follower. I can't remember your name right now. From New York, living in Pottstown. Um, told me it's on Instagram. 
told me in one of my comments, um, Chef Carmen and I would make good friends. I said, no, we wouldn't. I don't, like, I don't even like the lady. She's not, like, we're not on the same level. Speaking of levels, Carmen said, Treese will have to level up a thousand times to be on her level. She said, I'm not, people kept calling Carmen's phone saying, stop talking about that, texting her, like, stop talking about that, don't stoop to her level, they in the comments, putting it in the comments, don't stoop to her level. She said, I, I could never be on her level. She will have to level up a thousand times to be on my level, like, um... Where did I leave off at before that? Because I wanted to mention that. Dang it, man. Um, what the freak? Oh, come on, Sha. The lady said Carmen and I would be good friends. And I said, nah, right? Because I watch how Carmen and, let's say, um, Derek Green and his wife, Went to Vegas last year. If you don't know who Derrick Green and his wife are, they are, remember, uh, two years ago, um, in Atlanta at Carmen's old house with, when her and Stephanie were still together, a man with hazel eyes was there cooking for the weekend. And they did, like, different recipes and stuff at the crib. That's Derrick Green. He's on Facebook. He has his own cooking show on Facebook, him and his family. And they linked, you know, they kept in touch with um, Carmen, you know. And they went to Vegas together. It was the Greens' anniversary. It was Derrick and Anita's anniversary, the husband and wife's anniversary. And Carmen went out to, you know, chill with them. She ended up flying her niece out and her niece friends. And they got drunk. Like, they're buying the drinks on the boardwalk, which are watered down. I hate, I hate Vegas. I swear I hate Vegas. The times I went to Vegas was for my child. Circus, circus. I hate Vegas. I literally hate Vegas. I hate Vegas. I don't like Vegas. I don't like gambling. It's not the state. Please forgive me. I love Nevada. I love Nevada. I love Nevada. It's the Las Vegas. I don't like the the strip and the gambling and that that whole nine for whatever reasons. I'll make a video about that. The reasons I don't like it. There we go. They're at rest. They're at dinner at like a five star. It's the Greens' anniversary. If you don't know, I said that already. They're Carmen's age, 56 at the time. So they're about 58 or 59 now. All three of them, same age. They look good for the age. I know Carmen, too. I'm, I'm not a hater. She looks good for her age. Body, everything looks good. And um, they're drunk in a the restaurant. They're loud. The Greens are not, Derrick Green is a church man, like his father was a pastor, preacher, whatever, he was passed on, um, he was a choir boy, preacher kid, you know, uh, they aren't like church people now, for lack of better words, church people now, but they are more reserved, you know. They act their age, huh? Thank you. Well said. They act their age. They're mature. And you could see they were embarrassed at dinner. Um, it got so bad. Anita, the wife, said she wasn't feeling well. I don't know if she wasn't or was or was not feeling well, but I don't think she was. I think she faked it not to have to go out and spend that last night with Carmen and them. Um, um, it's crazy. Um, I wouldn't want. I said all this time I wouldn't want to be her. Like, uh, we're not on the same level.
Let me tell you, I learned this from Wendy Williams. Shout out to you, bro. Please get well. I'm so praying for you. Your video is coming soon, too, love. After watching this live today, after listening to this live and never hearing Carmen talk about Trees and her lack of cleanliness, I don't have a problem being that woman's friend. Carmen's. I don't have a problem being her friend. I'm a Taurus. We are genuine and we um we value friends. We value friends. You are our friend for a reason. If I call you a friend, you're my friend for a reason. Yeah. Oh. Um, I see loyal. I see loyal there. I see loyal there. I see loyal there. Not to mention Kareem is a 25-year friendship. Or plus, or more than 25-year friendship, you know. Um yeah, yeah, yeah. After hearing this live, I could, I, I, I don't want to ever, but I could be friend Carmen. I could if I had to. Um, I wouldn't, I couldn't tolerate that woman, no, honestly. Like, I couldn't, but she never talked about that. She didn't say before I cooked at your house every time I had to clean. She never talked about a stench or roaches, the nasty bathroom, trash running over the nasty refrigerator, the nasty microwave, the stuff Trees talked about, the stuff Trees talked about in her own house, the way Trees talked about her own self. The woman, Carmen, never said she smelled Trees. Trees has told her that she smelled herself. She said it might be a little pissy. You, you smell yourself. You smell a little pissy. Carmen never talked bad about her person. Her personal. She talked bad about her character. Ah. That's pretty deep. You're going to want to catch this. I'm telling you now. I'm going to tell you where what the live is titled. Let me see what other stuff did she say um, about uh, what did she say about B? Friendships puppets. You can't be friends with who you want to friends. Be friends with when Carmen first started off with the way she started off, I thought she was talking about somebody else with kids. Letting the kids sit there and do what they want and da da da. I was like, oh, I thought she was talking about that chick with the other. I'm like, whoa. I said, oh, Carmen feeling herself. She did sound like she was a little drinking. Now, speaking of a little drinking, Carmen also spoke on, I'm wrapping this up soon, too. I'm going to tell you where you can find this live at soon. Um, and then we're going to wrap this up. Uh, Carmen mentioned, Trees must be talking about when they went to the casino, because you know they were hanging out at one time. Mm-hmm. Carmen thought she had a friend. <laughs> Sucker. <laughs> All dead. I said it because I meant it. <laughs> My name's Child. Everything Child. Nuck if you buck. <laughs> so, <laughs> I've never said that. That must be some old head term. <laughs> They went to the casino. I gotta go on Tree's page. I don't even know what page she's on. Rennie's page, the page she made for her seven-year-old daughter at the time. Sad, or eight-year-old daughter at the time. Trees is must. Trees must be telling the world when they went to the casino. Carmen had to borrow money from her. Trees must be telling the world that when her and Carmen went to the casino together, Tr Carmen had to borrow money from Trees. So Carmen addressed that on this live 12 hours ago. Carmen said, everybody know when you go to the casino and you in there for a long time, after you take out a certain amount of money, you can't take out more. True. It's not whether you at the casino or not. 
It's called everyone has a daily spending limit. Where even if it's a large purchase and you're using your debit card or your credit card at the bank, you know, at that furniture store for this $8,000 living room set, or this $10,000, $12,000 living room set, right? Your daily spending limit is only $4,000 on debit, $5,000 on credit, but your spending limit, you to max that out with $8,000, you got to call the bank, speak to customer service. You need to tell them the exact dollar amount down to the cent of that purchase so they can approve that purchase one time. As soon as they do it, you sitting there at the customer service table at the dealership or at the uh, uh, furniture store, Ray Moore Flanagan for me, and you tell them, go ahead, it's approved, and they'll run, they'll swipe the card, and it'll say approved. Yeah. yeah. So you can call the bank. She could have called the bank and said, hey, you know, I'm stranded. Can you up my spending limit? You, right? She could have done that. Um... But I guess she don't know that. <sighs> Dealing with banks, you should know how banks operate and how banks are there for you. Same as your cell phone company. Anyway, <laughs> um, maybe I'll make a video about that for you one day. Who knows if I'll remember to do it. That's the problem. That thoughts pop in my head. And when I have the time, I don't remember. <laughs> um, Carmen said, yeah. Yeah, y'all know how it go. You can't take out more money because you maxed out for the day. So you borrow money from your friends and you give it back the next day. I have never done that. I have never done that. I've been to Vegas. I lived in Atlanta City. I have never done that. I have never done that. No one has never done that with me. No one has never hit me up like, yo, child, let me borrow something until tomorrow. No, because we go and we come back with more money than we, like, yeah. We go with enough money to do everything you need to do. Well, hell, we buy, we used to buy bottles. I used to buy bottles. I don't know what they do. I know them two don't buy bottles. <laughs> Those three don't buy. We used to buy bottles. Um, A $40 bottle of Moet in the liquor store. A hundred dollars when you go out, you know, so we make sure we got enough when we go out for everything. We gonna sit here and play blackjack all night. We gonna play roulette all night. Yeah, so we taking 10 stacks, whether we spend it or not, huh? So I don't know what Carmen talking about other than she was drunk. It wasn't thinking. But Carmen addressed that. She's like, I gave it back the next day. Well, she didn't say she gave it back the next day. She said, y'all know how you borrow money when you're in the casino. You give it back to your friend the next day. I got to see what Tree's talking about. Y'all just check it out. The name of the live, uh, Nook If You Buck in UK. If you be UCK, knuck if you buck. I guess knuckle up if you buck. I don't know. I guess that's some old head talk. Um, yeah, Carmen. I ain't mad at the way she addressed it. I ain't mad. I, 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 I don't know. I don't know what, what's the word I'm looking for? I don't know what spiked this. I don't know what set her off to even address all this. I don't know. I'm not on Facebook watch. I upload and I get off. I post and I get off. I'm a content creator. I'm not a content viewer. You know what I mean? So... I'm about to be, starting tonight, I'm about to be a content viewer. Going on these pages, I gotta see what I've been missing. Yeah. Um, 
Carmen wasn't all hype with it. She did just say a couple times she wanted Will Smith you. She wants the Will Smith you, Tree. She wanna smack this out you, girl. I can't call you a woman. I call it the way I see it. Girl, she wanna slap you. Like Will Smith slapped Chris Rock. I don't wanna see it happening. I don't want it to go down. But I'm telling you now, if it go down, my money is on you, Latrice. Don't, I'm girl. Don't you pull out no firearm on no punk behind Chef Carmen. If you do, then you a punk. And that make me stupid for putting my money on a punk. You ain't pull that firearm out on Coco when he was putting his hands on you. And you showed us him putting his hands on you. I, I seen you get hit by Coco. You never once pulled that firearm on him. And that would be called self-defense. She said knuckle up. I don't know what buck mean. Oh, well, yeah, 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 yeah. She said knuckle up. That's it, that's all. So, Trees, I would put $50 on you. That's it, because honestly, it's one hit. If it gets to one hit, because Carmen going to talk her way out of it. I ain't mean it like that. You know, I got love for you, but you know... You be talking like this, and that's when you got to end yours. And if you don't do that again, you a straight behind me. Real talk. And I'm stupid for putting my money on you. Because Carmen not about that life either. She said the kids are better off without their mother. That's what she said. That's what Carmen said. Carmen Atlanta Smith said, Latrice Island children are better off without their mother. That's deep. That's deep. That's deep. She said she wants to testify in court. She wants to testify in court. She said she got the tapes, the juice, something. She keeps saying something about Teresa saying, Teresa got to be putting out this. She got something more recording on all them ring cameras. Carmen said, if you got it, put it out there. Because you lying. That's why you ain't putting nothing out there. You can't put nothing out there. Because it ain't nothing to put out there. She said, but I, I... I remember the names you talked about. I know who you said you're going to get to do something to somebody. Yeah. And she know who the somebody is, too. Like, she's like, I'll testify in court. Like, whoa. So, I'm about to go on Facebook and give Facebook some viewer time. And give some content creators or... <laughs> Give some no lifers <laughs> some watch time. And um Latrice Allen. Latrice, I'm gonna give her some watch time. It's been a while. Um, Carmen said she's washed up. She's um her days are done on on the media. She said her days are done. She said nobody wants to see that drama. Nobody wants to see her lies. Nobody want to see a bully. Nobody want to see her mental health case behind. Um, nobody want to see her lack of parenting. Yeah, she went in. She went in without all the extra. Yeah. Spoke her mind. Spoke her mind. Um, yet people kept telling her, kept calling the phone like, yo, stop, chill. She said, no, I'm not going to stop. 
I'm tired of being fired. No, I'm t- I, I hate bullies. I don't like bullies. I don't know who Trees was bullying this time. I said this time. That's crazy. I don't know who Trees was bullying this time, but whoever she was bullying pissed Carmen off. Was she trying to piss Carmen? You know. I'm about to find out. I hope I find out. Now, Carmen did say Facebook was going to delete this live. Why would Facebook delete the live, Carmen? You ain't said nothing disrespectful. You wanted to cuss. You was about to cuss. You didn't even cuss. Why would they delete the live? You may delete the live. Knock if you buck is the name of the live, if you care. And please, please go watch it. Don't care, but go watch it. Entertain yourself. You ain't even got to watch it because I ain't watch it. I wish I would sit and watch somebody's live. Listening to it is enough for me while I'm on the elliptical or walking them streets or jogging because I walk and jog. I walk one block, I run one block. I walk one block, I run a block, yeah. That's on Facebook. If you want to see me doing that, it's on Instagram too. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm out walking and running. I'll give it to y'all one day. I'm out walking and running, yeah. Um. So if you want to see more of my videos, different kind of content, different kind of videos, feel free, feel free. It's public page, everything shy, S-H-I, the same as this. YouTube channel you're watching now, it's a Facebook page, so search pages, not people. And I have a TikTok account, Everything Shy. I'm on Clubhouse, Everything Shy. And I have an Instagram fan page for you, where some videos will go on Instagram before they go on Facebook. Um, other things are made just for Instagram pictures just for Instagram, all that stuff. Like, I just put one up of my mother and my daughter tonight, Throwback Thursday. Picture's about 23 years old, wow. So, yeah, check me out, you know, you can DM me, Everything Shy, on Instagram. You can inbox me, Everything Shy, on Messenger. Be patient. I'll get back to you. Um. Definitely check out Chef Carmen's. I don't know what her page is these days because you know she keep getting new pages. Must be hard out there. Um, it's going down once again. Same drama, different people. And her. Her don't change. She's the common denominator. Trish, you're the common denominator. She said, next to every dictionary in the world should be her face next to narcissist. She said, Exodus, Exodus, the book of Exodus is about trees. Like, <laughs> yo, I'm done. Thank you for watching Everything Shy again. Everything Shy, whatever platform you're on, search me. Most likely, I'm on that platform as well. Happy almost Friday. We going to come back with another one tomorrow, most likely, because I'm going to find out something. Question is, am I going to remember to come back tomorrow? I'm joking. I'll see you tomorrow because we coming back because it's getting good.